You seen this? Yeah, I heard about it. It's a cop body comp down at Bungella tomorrow. Thought I might go down and take a few photos. Yeah? Well, there's not as much competition in the cop body mags. If I get a good shot, one of them might publish it. $15,000 prize money. Wow. Yeah, you should enter. Get real. Deb and Simmer wouldn't let me. No outside comms, remember? Well, what they don't know won't hurt them. Wanna come? Uh, you guys go, I'll catch up. How are you getting down there? Train. I rang my grandma, she lives just outside Bungella. She's gonna pick me up from the station. Why? It's not like a regular competition. There are no heats. No, no, it's an expression session. Everybody's out there at once, you got two days to show off all your stuff. What about Deb and Simo? It's Saturday, you're having some time off. I would need someone to help me land the kite. Reckon you could do it? Easy. Hey, Anna. Hi. Just checking that you still want to do that extra session this afternoon. You wanted some help in the gym. Ah, oh, yeah, yeah. Um, sorry, Deb, can we reschedule? Yeah, sure, what's up? A science project. Me and Joe are doing ours together. What's it on? Reproduction. Uh, yeah, plant a flower. We need to go to the national park. Okay, well, have fun. Oh, I'm starving. Same. Let's go get an egg and bacon roll. Oh, perfect. I could eat two plus a milkshake. You coming, class? Especially meeting Heath to start the science project. Sunny. Grandma took him in from the pan about a couple of months he's ago. Gorgeous. Yeah. <laughs> he might be gorgeous, but he's a pain in the backside. He won't do a thing I tell him. Okay, Sunny. Up, up, up. One, two. Come on. Up. Yes. Yes. Oh, hello. Hi. This is Anna. Hello, Anna. How are you? Bye. It's really good to see you. Okay, let's go. No, I haven't seen you all morning. What time did he say he'd be there? Nine o'clock. I waited three quarters of an hour in the boiling heat. It was his idea we did this stupid project together in the first place. Oh, will you chill out? The project's not even due for another two weeks. Yeah, and Anna's the only other person crazy enough to give up her Saturday in the name of science. What's Anna doing hers on? She and Joe are doing something on flannel flowers. I don't know, they took off early this morning. Joe's not with Anna, he's down the beach. Oh, well, I'm sure that's what Deb said. Maybe she went on her own. Fly, are you okay? Yep. No, you're not. You're upset about Heath. I'm not upset, I'm just annoyed. Oh, well, why don't you ring him then? Ask him why he didn't show. Why should I call him? He's the one who didn't show. Oh, Fly, come on, will you just ring his mobile and sort it out? I'm sure there's a really simple explanation. Okay. Thanks, Grant. All right. 
God, I'm so sorry. Uh, where, where am I? I'm, uh, I'm down the coast visiting my grandma. Yeah, yeah, she's not well. So, uh, it, it's her heart? Yeah, you see, she, she's got a, a, a dog and it, it needs feeding and the neighbours are away and, yep, I'm really the only one that can do it. He forgot. See, that's what I thought. So where is he? Down the coast. He reckons his grandma's sick. Yeah, right. Hang on, isn't Heath pretty close to his grandma? But why would Anna lie to Deb about going somewhere with Joe? Yeah, it sounds a little bit sus to me. What, you're thinking that Anna and Heath have gone somewhere together? I don't know. Certainly looks that way. You with the mag? No, it's just a hobby of mine, really. You? I'm from Kite Rider. Our magazine's one of the sponsors. Yeah, really? Because I thought, um, if I got any good shots, I'd take it to a few mags, see if anyone's interested. I think you'd be wasting your time, to be honest. We've pretty much got the whole comp covered. Angela kiteboarding competition. She entered the competition and he's gone down to help her land the kite. Is Anna's kiteboarding gear down there? It's missing. You were right. Oh well, now we know. But why couldn't he just tell me? You should give him a serve. I agree. Fly, you're too nice about things. You guys had an arrangement. He stood you up and he needs to know that that's not good enough. Anonymous judges, anyway. They don't know time when they see it. visiting his sick grandma. You said she was in hospital. Okay, I lied. But only because Anna didn't want Deb and Simmer to find out that she was going in the comp. But I'm not Deb and Simmer, am I? You're right. 
I'm sorry. And I'm sorry you dragged yourself all the way down here, but for what it's worth, I'm glad you're here. Apology accepted. <laughs> so, where is she? She's out the back there. Deb and Simmer around? No. Great. Found them. Hey, how'd you go? I bet you blew them away. Is there anyone who doesn't know about it? Don't worry, secret's safe with us. Did you score a place? It's a two-day comp, but I'm not going very well. You're a German champion in your age group. You must be shooing it in. She should be. She's easily as good as the other girls. She's just not scoring. Why not? I reckon it's simple. She's not scoring because she's not putting herself out there enough. I reckon you need to do something to get their attention. I'm a sports person, not a performer. All I'm saying is you can't afford to be shy. Heath, I heard your grandmother wasn't very well. Uh, no, 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 she's fine. Yeah, she's a lot better now. Oh, good. Starfish, you started already. Yep. We're still doing the assignment. Together though, yeah? Sure. But if you think I'm doing all the work, forget it. I wasn't. We'll do it in halves. I'll do female stuff here, shoot him now. Well, the assignment's on reproduction. I have to cross over at some point. We'll get to that. Hey, um, I wanted to say sorry again for standing you up today. It's just this opportunity to get a photo published. And... I'm fine, Heath. Really. Just remember, I'm not going to be dropped like a hot potato whenever a better offer comes along. Signal's coming through loud and clear. Good. What are you doing? Just getting prepared for tomorrow. You're right back into this, aren't you? Not really. Yeah, right. Good. Sunny, hey. Oh, wait. Hey. Sunny. Sunny, sit. How are you going? Sunny, sit. Sunny, get down, Sunny. Sit. Zed stick. <gasps> what did you say? Zed stick. It's German for sit. <laughs> Platz. Oh, hey, boy. Mach eine Rolle. <laughs> Oh. I get it. He's a German shepherd in disguise. He isn't disobedient. He just doesn't speak English. He must have had a German owner somewhere along the line. Well, I think he likes you. And I like you, don't I, Sonny? Maybe you two could take him to the beach with you. Oh, no, Grandma, I don't, I don't think that's... He a... loves the beach. Grandma, I love you very much, but your dog is a handful. Exactly. I need a break. Please, just for today. Just while I replant my garden. Come on, Heath. It's the least we can do. Yeah, all right. Great. <laughs> OK, let's go. Hey, Grandma, if um, somebody should call you, you're not feeling very well. <laughs> Got it. Love to. Come on. Oh, come on. Yay! Yay! still not scoring. Maybe she could use some support. Didn't she say she didn't want us there? Yeah, but what she wants and what she needs might be different things. Beat's working on the science project. I'll call Joe. Hey. Hey, How's man. Uh-oh. Where are you 
guys off to? He's, um, Grandma. Oh, yes, I heard she wasn't well. No, we're going down to help Heath with arrangements and stuff. Arrangements? She's got a dog that needs looking after and a few things to be sorted out. Right, guys? Oh, I didn't know. I'm so sorry. Well, you'd better go. Just give Heath my love. Hey. Yep. Bran, you know how I said you're not well? Well, you just got worse. Down there. How's she going? Have a look. This whole thing is a joke. Competitors breakfast this morning? No. Talk to anyone, play volleyball. I'm down here to kiteboard. I know, but like I said, if you want to get noticed, you have to paint myself green. Hey, that's a good idea. Or even better, wear no clothes at all. <laughs> <laughs> Nude kiteboarding, hey, that could work. Thanks for your help, guys, but I think I'll just try some good airs instead. <laughs> Having a competition based on personality more than ability. I agree, so we have to help Annie get noticed. with Heath. His grandma passed away. Really? Yeah. His mum must be pretty upset. I wonder if we should find out if she needs any help. Yeah. Good idea.
division. First prize goes to Adam Peterson. Come forward. Well done, well done, well done, well done. You were the one covering this girl over the last couple of days, weren't you? Uh, yeah, that's right. I'd uh, like to take a look at some proof sheets, see what you got. You, uh, yeah, sure. Your cash to your new kiteboarding companion, Sonny. What do you reckon, guys? <laughs> In addition to the prize money, Anna has also won a place on the South Coast Junior kiteboarding team. They'll be leaving in a month and touring for 10 weeks overseas. What about that, guys? Yes. Yeah. The only thing is, we won't be able to pay for Sonny's airfare. Can you manage to go without him? Why didn't you say something? Because I knew you wouldn't want me to enter. Well, you got that right. Didn't you think we'd eventually find out once you'd won the competition? It's kind of hard to keep it a secret when you're touring with the South Coast kiteboarding team. But I didn't think I'd win. I didn't think I'd get on the team. Anna, you must have known you were in with a good chance. You were junior girls champion in your own country. Still, I haven't had a lot of practice lately. Enough. This tour starts in a month. You can't finish the year here if you go. Looks like you've got a big choice to make. asking me to choose between the two spots I love. I can't do that. Maybe you should consider the kiteboarding tour. It's a great opportunity, you love the sport, you're good at it, and it's a sure thing. Whereas no matter how hard you try on the solar blue comp, you've only got a one in four chance of winning. Anything could happen. If you gave up the kiteboarding trip and you didn't win the wild card, you'd be pretty disappointed. Money. I decided to give it back. I'm not going on tour. You sure about this? Yeah. I came to Australia to see if I could make it as a surfer. And I still want to find out. That's great, Anna. But only if you're sure. There are other tours and I know that I can kiteboard. I said I'd stay for the year and that's what I'm going to do. You're pulling out? You can't. Why not? Well, because I just found out one of the photos I took of you is going on the cover of Kite Rider. They're devoting the whole issue to the touring team. So? Well, if you pull out, they pull the photo. Can't you just hold off on telling them? Hold off? Yeah, just a couple of weeks until the magazine goes to print. That wouldn't be fair. Fair? OK, what's fair about this? My first opportunity to get a photo published and you want to go and do the right thing. They might still publish your photo? Yeah, just not on the front cover. It'll be black and white and buried on page 37. Oh, well, maybe now you can concentrate on your assignment. For your information, I've done my half the assignment. I've written everything there is to know about male starfish. Good. And you've done your bit about the female starfish. Now we've just got to put them together. That's your job. Says who? I'm doing design and presentation. Have you taken assertive pills? You've gone all bossy and stuff. I just decided I needed to start speaking my mind. Yeah? Good. Because if everyone was a bit more straightforward about things, I can be a lot easier. <laughs>